Hi everyone, uh, this is Clement calling for Friday 17th of September 2021. I'm Miriam Murphy, I'm the Families and Young People Worker here at Clement. At this episode I am giving you an update of the youth work and young people's work and families work here at Clement after the lockdown season. We have renamed our Sunday school um, in as youth church, which is what it used to be the Renu, and junior church for the younger ones from P primary school and also for the younger toddlers, they're all part of the junior church. And we have a very varied program for our young ones on Sunday mornings now that we gather again as a church family celebrating God and uh, faith in our church at 10.30 on Sundays. And basically for every single Sunday, we have a little bit of a different program. So for one of the Sundays, we don't call it Sunday service, but we call it service Sunday. We want our young people to learn to serve the church and understand that being at church is not about coming to be entertained, but it's about serving each other. So we ha are inviting our young people to take up roles that are usually, um, which, are around, which are in the church, like welcoming people at the door or playing or singing in the band or helping at the tech desk, the different things that um, we do at the church when we serve each other, we, the young people are going to do on one Sunday a month and we call it Service Sunday. On another Sunday each month, we are baking, making waffles and this is we call Waffle Brunch. Here at the Waffle Brunch, we have the Junior Church and Youth Church together we all help each other to make a lovely, yummy brunch for us. Uh, we have waffles and we have fresh orange juice. And we're still looking for people to come and help us out. So if you are looking for something to do at church and you think you're good with young people, please contact me and maybe you could help us out in the waffle brunch and get to know the young church, our junior church and our youth church. Then one of the Sundays we have recreate our new innovative, interactive, creative um, service that we are um, trialing and launching this Sunday 19th of September. After a clip from the message bus, um, there is a clip explaining recreate and you can learn more about it there. And all the junior church and youth church are warmly welcome to take part in Recreate at lunchtime 12 o'clock this Sunday and it will be also on the 24th of October, 21st of November and 19th of December. On those Sundays when Recreate is on, and we won't have our official program for our junior church and youth church, but there will be creche available in vestibule where parents can sit and look after their little ones and at the same time watch the service on the screen. And that is available on every Sunday anyhow. On a final Sunday, what we want the kids to do is to learn from the Bible, but we are going to use the same material than the adults are in the focus groups. So we will call it On Focus. And this is our formal Bible study um, with the themes that we are all learning at the church in focus groups. And basically it is the focus group for everyone with I under 18. Next, you will see a short clip filmed at the Message Bus this um, week by Heather Shanks. Message Bus is a cooperation with Message Trust Scotland, who are bringing a double-decker bus to the St. Leonard Square, where kids and young people can join us as we are having different activities on the bus. There's a climbing frame, there is FIFA, there is Wii, there is Nail Bar. You will see it all on, a, uh, on the clip that is follows and uh, you can see what we do there. Every um, night on a Wednesdays for the next six weeks, the message bus will be um, at the Tesco car park from 7 till 8.30. So every, if you have teens, please do send them over. It is so much fun. And um, also on the night, every night we have a little card slot where we will give testimonies of how God has changed our lives and how God is relevant to all of us as leaders um, and our, we share our experiences with God with the kids. Please pray. It is an amazing outreach opportunity. It is meant to lead to a youth alpha, uh, which will the, on the sixth week inter be introduced to the kids who are at the bus. And we are praying that many of them would join us to the next adventure with us, which is, as I said, the youth alpha. Enjoy the clips. And the final clip there is about the recreate service this Sunday. 
Enjoy. Good, yeah, that's scarier than that. <laughs> Are you, do you want me to be hospitalised, no, Master? Are we doing a bit of everybody else on the bus? Me, I'm fine, sir. <laughs> In the beginning, God created. God made the heavens and the earth. Creativity is in our veins. It's in our blood, in our genes. It's in our makeup. The way we were made as the image of, a cre of the creator God. Being creative means making something new and different. Looking at things from a different angle. Mixing in a bit. We cannot create ex nihilo from nothing, only God can, but we can recreate things. He's made, rearrange them, ponder them, and make our contribution to them. This Sunday, on 19th of September, at 12 o'clock, we will gather to celebrate our creativity in God's house. We will use uh, the Bible, the scripture, as our inspiration for our creations. And we have a different ways of doing our creations, such as painting and other pictorial arts, music, drama, and IT, that means digital arts, and writing or calligraphy. We also have a craft table for those who are not quite sure to try out the bigger workshops. It is for all ages, so for the youngest of the family all the way to the oldest one. So please bring your family and come and see. And if you're not sure to take part, you can also come and observe. So the next time when we have it on the 24th of October, you come prepared. Now, you, we do have lunch first at 12 o'clock at Large Hall, so please bring your packed lunch and a drink with you and for all of those who are coming. See you there. Sophia, what art form do you want to try out at Recreate? Um, well, um, maybe the drama, the music or the art form. They all sound really good to me, so I guess I'll just decide. <laughs> Have you used a Bible scripture verse or a theme for any of your pictures that you've made? Yeah, I have, but not as much as I do other art, if that makes any sense. Do you have any questions about Recreate? Um, I was wondering, like, um, like, how long are this, like, the services? Yes, it's from 12 o'clock till one fifteen. about, we'll see how long it takes to make the, all the pieces of art. So that's about an hour and a 15 minutes? And yes. That sounds a great time in my opinion, but, um... Also, um, are you able to like switch arts in between like one month you had art or something and then to say the next month you want a drama or something? Could you do that? Yes, you can do oh. that. You can just try out one and then next month on the 24th of October, Sounds try great. a different one. Sounds great. Can't wait to come. Please. <laughs>